Well, I have to do some uh, pest control on the farm, the mate's farm. So, uh, just loaded up the stuff on my hide. Uh, throw decoys, a rifle, 28 ball shotgun, often poles, that's a carousel there, motorised, put three crows on that, got some uh, hangers for in the trees there, not used them yet, they're new, got my seat, got my hide in there, my hide poles, all good to go, I think. Right, get the door shut. Hey, would you written a my camo bag? I saw my long sewing machine, made it myself. Ideal. Right, crack on. What time is it? It's about seven o'clock now, it's ten to seven AM. Let you know how I go on later. farm Good to go down here Trusty old 28 bore, 3rd inch barrels, does the job perfect in the hide. Lovely views. Gone quiet here now, so packed up. That's where the duck landed. Up on the side of the hide there, against the fence. So we're going to have a look in them fields in front of me over there. And then, uh, <laughs> let's see what it's, uh, what I can see on the marsh. I'll have a look tonight for the foxes. I've had a few around here. That field there, 17 on there in four nights. Oh, 18. 18 it was. Yeah, right, catching a bit. I'm just going to take my hide down now. The net here, I've already took most of it down, collected my decoys. The lofting poles there. Two crows on it. So yeah. It's a cartridge they use, Regal. Twenty-eight bore. Number fives, twenty-eight gram. Right, crack on. I'll load it back into the truck. 
and then we'll have a drive over there. That's it. <coughs> Turn the gear back in. All nice and tidy there. No empty cartridge shells about. They crow over there now, typical. Right, let's go and have a look up the fields. See what's going on up there. See my thing there. Show me a pair. Mm. Oh cool, it's actually got them in white instead of black. They stood out more. Right, let's go and have a ride up here. Oh, let's go and have a nosey. Mm. Won't take long to get up here. The marsh is a wet place, so when you get a place like that, you should always check in the daytime where you're gonna go. You don't get bloody stuck. <laughs> I mean, I've been coming near years, so I know the land. So, uh, I like to still have the ride round in the daytime and think in my mind what I'm going to do, where I'm going to go, what my plan is and then when I come in the dark I just stick to that plan I've made in the day There's the marsh up there to the top up there that might be a good place to sit and call them from this marsh because they will be in here just the other side of the marsh there you can see that hedge that's the old railway Thermal. I don't see them anywhere on the other fields on the other side to the top of the hill. Which is running up to somewhere around about 600, 800 metres. Oh, I can easily see a fox there. Oh, what I don't want is anything coming from behind me, be on that edge, in case I don't see them. So I'm going to check it out now. Let's have a look. Yeah, it's bump here. Just put you on pause. Right, I'm back. Okay, um, seen a little low spot on the hedge here, and a little bit further down there. So if I were to park here, and the grass is quite long. That's going to be cut for silage. Actually, this is a little bit lower here. There. Go a little bit further, and I can set my sticks up there to shoot off. Right.
an old issues railway down there. Always plenty of cubs. Tonight. Lots of verse along it. Let's see what we can do tonight. Bye for now.